Alzheimer's, an urgent epidemic. Alzheimer's disease has been around for thousands of years, and it's always been a personal and family tragedy. But now, it's becoming a social catastrophe. That's because people are living longer than ever before, thanks to modern medicine. Hundreds of millions of people reaching their 70s, 80s, and 90s. Sadly, the risk of getting Alzheimer's increases with every year of age. Worldwide, roughly 1% of 65-year-olds have the disease. That shoots up to nearly 10% of 75-year-olds and about 20% of 85-year-olds. Already, 24 million people across the world have this fatal disease, and that's expected to double over the next 20 years and then double again, if we don't do something to slow it down or stop it. Costs will skyrocket and threaten to bankrupt national health care systems. This is a disease that will cripple economies and communities everywhere. The good news is that scientists now understand much about how Alzheimer's ravages the brain, and they have many good ideas about how to stop it. The bad news is that Alzheimer's research is expensive and slow, and doesn't get nearly the government support that it urgently requires. In short, we are facing an excruciating and ruthlessly expensive epidemic. As a society, we cannot afford to let this disease continue on its present course. We must fight Alzheimer's with every ounce of effort. Please do your part by helping your friends, neighbors, and elected representatives understand the urgency of the Alzheimer's epidemic. Thank you. Learn more at www.aboutalz.org.